Hi everyone, welcome back. So today I'm sitting down to film a very exciting challenge. So this challenge was created by Shreya Jain and I am so excited to be filming this. So her challenge was to do a full face of makeup using products and tools only under rupees 100. Now I went shopping for it last evening and it was so so challenging oh my god first of all the people who were helping me shop thought that i was nuts because they were showing me so many products and like those products were like 120 150 and i was like nope nope i want something cheaper than that cheaper than that and they were like giving me weird looks because uh, I'm sure nobody came in to shop like that and I was just sitting on the head I'm like nay or they cow or they cow kya hai waha dekho waha dekho just show me everything that you have and um, finally I am successful with it so I went to beautiful and I got my stuff over there and everything that I bought is inside of this so everything is brand new I haven't tried uh, most of these so I am keeping my fingers crossed and I'm hoping that everything is going to go well. So yeah, if this is the first time you're watching my video, make sure that you subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and give this video a big, big thumbs up before you start watching and let's get into the video. I am starting off with my face first and I am also going to use lactocalamine as my primer. This one's for oily to normal skin. So I have very oily skin, which is why I'm going to use this like Ashreya mentioned in her video this has a lot of glycerin so it's going to make sure that your makeup stays put and I actually got this a long time ago but it was just sitting there um, somewhere hidden and I had to like search it up again uh, this one's pretty cheap uh, this was priced at rupees 60 and this is the small bottle the smell actually reminds me of my hostel days because a lot of girls used to use this I actually got three things for my base and I didn't know which one would work the best. Uh, so I have three options. Uh, this one's a full on foundation and this was priced at Rs 95. Uh, this is from this brand called VOV um, and it's their prefix makeup studio range. And this is their stay up liquid foundation and I got the shade medium beige. Then I also got the Garnier BB Cream. I've heard good things about this. Um, I know a lot of people who use this and this was priced at Rs 69. This is the smallest tube. And then I got something from a brand that I completely detest and I do not want to endorse it in any way whatsoever. Uh, but I got the Fair and Lovely BB Cream, uh, which says that it's a foundation plus fairness cream so I could use this to like highlight underneath my eyes or something because um, obviously this is going to be extremely light for most Indian skin tones. For my base I actually found a makeup sponge and this was actually uh, priced at rupees 130 so I thought it was just 30 rupees extra and this is the only thing that I cheated in this challenge I promise uh, but I just thought this would come in really really handy in the challenge and this is from this brand called Bonito and it comes in this like packaging sort of thing and I'm so excited to use it I'm so happy I found a blender this is going to make my life so much easier uh, I think I'm going to start off with the Garnier BB cream all over my face making like so much on my fingers and then just going to oh that's a lot and it's too light for me it also kind of stings on my face I hope it does not react. Um, I think it just gave like a sheer, sheer coverage. So I think I might have to go over um, the BB cream with the foundation because I have a lot of redness on my face. So this is what the foundation looks like. Um, it comes in a pretty cute bottle. It says it's cute. It's suitable for skin types. Pumping a little bit onto the back of my hand, warming it up a little bit just so that it's easier to blend. And then I'm just going to place it. Okay, it's too light. And then I'm going to use the Bonito Magic Blender. Is it even doing anything? 
So also going in very patchy. I don't know if you can tell, but the sponge is leaving like circular marks. And I think it's not letting the foundation blend well. Oh God, my face is lighter than my neck. Okay. I don't like this. It's so patchy. Okay, I look really white. Try to fix it using bronzer later on. And the creams are also making me sweat more than usual. And the sweat is displacing everything. Let's move on to concealer. Hopefully I can fix all these using concealer. Um, for concealer, I actually got something from this brand called uh, Glam 2-1. Cosmetics Paris London New York in the shade natural beige professional makeover correction concealer and this was uh, priced at rupees 95 so it was below 100 um, it comes in like the stick style packaging I love the consistency of this it's very creamy I like this concealer blending very well my god I love this now to bake my face I got something really really interesting and it's actually using Johnson's baby powder to bake your face so I'm really excited to try this uh, this was priced at rupee 60 so it's below 100 and this is made for baby so I hope it's safe for my face it has talc uh, fragrance sodium citrate and citric acid uh, which hopefully aren't too harmful on my face it doesn't smell like it used to smell it smells very very different i think i'm just going to take a little bit on my hand like this and then i'm going to take my damp sponge like so and then use that to bake and I'm going to apply it underneath my eyes and everywhere else I've applied the concealer uh, just so that the product does not slide around on my face. It's working quite well. So far so good. It actually sits really well. I really like this. Wow. Nice. Let's move on to the eyes next. I am actually going to do my eyebrows. Uh, this one is from this brand called Me Now. And guess how much this was for. It also has a comb. This was priced at rupees 25 only. Uh, but I couldn't find it in brown. So I got it in black. So I'm going to be very, very careful and uh, very gentle. And I'm going to use it very sparsely. I think I'm going to remove my bake now. Um, I actually got this brush, which is from this random brand called EBM. This was priced at rupee 65. It's not very soft, but I think it'll do a good job of removing the bake from my face. I think it looks much better after removing uh, the bake. So for my eyes, I'm starting off with this golden pencil. I'm just going to scribble the pencil all over my eyes. It's just adding a nice warmth onto my eyes. Next, I'm going to take this eyeliner, which is a matte eyeliner that I got from Insight. And this was uh, priced at rupees 90, but he cut it off and he uh, made the price 75. So that's a win-win for me. Now I'm just going to draw a really nice dramatic winged liner using this. Now I'm going to take the silver eye pencil and then just use it on my inner corner just to highlight it a little bit. I'm also going to take a little bit of the black eyeliner 
and use that on my waterline just on the outer corner then I'm gonna take this brush and dip it a little bit into the black eyeshadow and I'm going to use that on my lower lash line Moving on to mascara, I am going to use this one that I got uh, for rupees 90. Uh, this is again from VOV and this is from their prefix makeup range. Uh, this is their Mega Curl Mascara. It's very separating but not volumizing at all. The mascara almost did nothing but anyway I'm just going to roll with it. Uh, for contouring I'm going to use this uh, from Olivia which is a waterproof pancake and I got it in the shade natural beige. Uh, now this one was priced at rupees 95 and this one's actually a pancake which is like two shades darker than mine. I'm just going to use this uh, using the sponge and just use that to contour my face. This is actually a really old brand. My mom actually recognized this brand. I actually have seen like um, hair removal cream also from this brand. For blush, I am going to use this Miss Claire eyeshadow. Uh, this is in the shade 240 and this was priced at rupees 90. It's a very deep uh, magenta sort of pink. I hope it's not as pigmented. Uh, I'm just going to take a little bit on my fingers and then, oh, it is pigmented. I am just going to tap a little bit onto my cheeks. That's actually a lot. So for highlighter, I actually got this loose pigment which was actually for just 10 rupees. Uh, this is from this brand called Midi and it's their translucide shimmer glitter. This is for 10 rupees is what it says in the back. So it's just pure pressed pigment. I'm very scared to use this. It's just... Then uh, for lipstick, I'm going to use this one which I'm very excited about. It looks exactly like the LA Girl Flat Finish Matte Gloss but it's actually from Kiss Beauty and this is priced at rupees 100 uh, but he actually reduced the amount to rupees 90 for me. Uh, so I was very happy but they were originally selling it for rupees 100. I am very excited to try this shade. It's in the shade number 15. So this is the finished look. I love the lipstick. It's much better than the original one actually. Um, it's not as patchy as the LA Girl one. The eyeliner has set down completely matte. So I really like this. The mascara didn't really do anything. My eyebrows are way too fierce uh, because it's black and I don't really like the base. I didn't really like any one of the BB cream. I didn't like the Fair and Lovely one. I didn't like the Garnier one and I did not like uh, the VOV prefix uh, liquid foundation but you can actually give this one a go if you want to try like baking and you don't want to spend a lot on translucent powder I think it felt very similar to the RCMA powder that I was using yeah that's the finished look thank you so much Shreya for coming up with something so much fun and uh, yeah it was very nice to do this so that's it thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this let me know what you thought of it in the comments down below and i'll check them out and also i'll try and find the products out if i can find them online then i'm going to link it in the information box for you guys and that's it make sure that you're subscribed and i'll see you soon bye